Hello everyone and welcome to Make Me Scientific. In this video, we will understand the setup of resistances in series and then find the equivalent resistance using Ohm's law. I have taken here two 5 ohm resistances and using the connecting wires connect their ends as shown. Please ensure that the connections are tight. Connect the positive terminal, the red one of the battery with the positive terminal of the ammeter. Connect the negative black terminal of the ammeter with this end of the rheostat shown here. Remember, if you want to use rheostat as variable resistor, use these two ends. Connect the other end of rheostat as shown with an A of the resistor number 1. Connect end B of the resistor number 2 with negative terminal of the battery. This is how electric current will flow through the circuit. Please note the same amount of current passes through both the resistors as the current doesn't split up. Connect positive terminal of the voltmeter with end A of the resistor number 1 from which the current enters resistance number 1. Connect end B of resistor number 2 with the negative terminal of the voltmeter. And B is the one through which the current leaves the resistor number 2. The battery is set at 4 volts, adjusting the resistance using the rheostat, the current readings and the voltage readings are 0.2 amperes and 2 volts respectively. Please note that 2 volt is the potential difference across both the resistors or equivalent resistance. Current and voltage readings are 0.3 amperes and 3 volts. Adjusting the battery voltage at 2 volts and sliding the jockey the current and voltage readings are 0.1 ampere and 1 volts. Current and voltage readings are 0.2 ampere and 2 volts. Increasing the battery voltage to 6 volts, the current and the voltage readings are 0.4 amperes and 4 volts. Let's record our observations in the observation table. Please understand that the voltmeter will always measure the potential difference between two ends of the equivalent resistance. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching the video.